Hello folks, um, I'm back to do uh, part two of my recording um, of, of the tunes from this tape, James Byrne, The Road to Glenlock. Um, I'm going to do the rest of the tunes from um, the first sides, uh, side one of the tape. Um, and uh, I'll just get right into it. The first one is The Devil's Dream, and um, this is not the usual Devil's Dream, um, which is uh, well known and played uh, especially in old-timey circles in the United States, um, that, you know, the... that thing, except they like to go really fast. Anyway. No, this goes, this is totally different. Like so. All right, here it is slowly. The Devil's Dream, real. A single reel. tune. I feel a little wrong saying that about the devil's dream. Yeah, all right, so here we go. Thank you. 
is next? Oh, right. Um, what is it called, though? It's a barn dance. Yes, McConnell's Barn Dance. Um, I learned this from somewhere else, but then I ended up uh, learning this very slightly different version too. I think from Danny O'Donnell. I need to record some Danny O'Donnell sometime. He's one of my favorites. Of course, I've got a lot of favorites. All right, so O'Connell's, McConnell's? Yes, McConnell's Barn Dance. tunes very tuneful tune and so ah it's the uh, grandfather clock again
McConnell's uh, McConnell's um, barn dance uh, now um, up to speed. <laughs> next um oh john burns jig all right john burns jig not sure which burn this was there were a lot of burns not all, all of them in uh, in uh, james's own family this might have been a cousin or something I don't know. Uh, in an unusual tune um, it's labeled here as uh, as just a, a jig I think it can be called a single jig and I, and I think the liner notes of the tape actually call it a uh, it's like a slide oh, maybe so um, or you know a lot of slides I think are single jigs or vice versa anyway 
So here it is at, at a medium speed. a nice one um okay and here's here's one of the um uh, of donegal's uh better known reels i would say it's like um diagnostically diagnostically donegalish it's called the glory reel which is actually a a like an anglicization of the of the the Irish, which is real na glor or something like that, which means the reel of drones, um, because of, of this this part. Um, anyway, you'll 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 hear. Oh, maybe a little slower.
might have been playing um, so, some she, C sharps when I meant to be playing natural. You listen and make sure. So, and so by the way, this. It's, it's just a very unusual sequence in, in a reel. You just practically don't hear it in any other, anything like it in any other tune. So those would be the, the drones. playing the drones you always play always on the up bow this is something that that um that james personally emphasized to me and he wasn't the only donegal fiddle, fiddler who who mentioned this that that basically the the uh the beat where possible i guess is played with an up bow not a down bow i don't know maybe they're just being contrary i'm not really sure what the the point of that is but i think it does help give the, the Donegal style, uh, it's flavor. It's part of what gives us it, its flavor. <laughs> Altan, um, they played a very rousing version of that, and, and they, they probably um, are as responsible as anyone for, for popularizing the tune. Okay, ah, okay, and the last tune on the, uh, on side one is called the Mad Jig. So the Mad Jig is kind of an unusual jig, kind of like the, the Fickle Lad, which is also an unusual jig. This is unusual because it goes down here. 
Now, when I first learned this, I wasn't very good at playing with my fourth finger. So I just got used to playing it like this. Like so. But I think you might do better that if I were to relearn it doing that, it would take too much effort. So I decided not to relearn it that way. So here we go, slowly, the mad jig. C part.
to speed. performance of that tune. I guess that's that's um, appropriate. All right. 